Hey everyone, this is your man Harris. Yeah, sorry it's been a while since I posted. Right now I'm driving, so you may hear some background noise. So I'm sorry about that. Um, I'll try to make it as quiet as I can. I know it's been a while since I posted. So, and I will be bringing some more song suggestions to you guys. So just look for that. But really, I just want to talk about um, this is more of a message, more like a shout out. I don't know if Will Smith has a TikTok. I'm pretty sure he does. And, uh, you know, I'm a big fan of Will Smith. And uh, just want to say, yo, man, you can do better than Jada, man. For real. You can do better than Jada. All right. This woman has disrespected you. She has emasculated you, man. She has made you look like a damn clown. She has made you go up there and slap a man, which cost you to be able to go to those festivities in the future for what, like the next 10 years, ruin your reputation for a woman who treats you like shit. Now she got this book out here bringing all y'all business up into the street, letting everybody know your business, talking about how bad she got it. Give me a mother, give me a motherfucking break. Really? I mean, let's be real. When was the last time Jada Pickett starred in a hit movie? I mean, let's be real. I mean, I'm not trying to put the woman down and everything like that. But, you know, she, if it wasn't for Will, if she wasn't married to Will, her ass would be probably working in a McDonald's, um, being known as a washed up actress. Okay, let's be real. Since she's gotten with Will Smith, she hasn't done really shit. The last movie she was in that made any kind of money was Matrix. And that shit came out in the night, you know, in the 90s. Get the fuck out of here with that. She starred in like a hospital series that didn't go nowhere. Okay. So really, how bad does she have it? She get to pretty much be married to one of the highest paid actor, actors in Hollywood. And like I said, I like Will Smith music too. I think he gets a lot of shit from weak ass brothers that say he ain't black enough, which is bullshit. I, I'll make another video on that note. But anyway, um, this dude, Will Smith, is one of the highest paid actors in fucking Hollywood. Definitely one of the highest paid black actors. Jada Pickett hasn't done shit. Not a damn thing, really. And I think it was on that hospital show that there was rumors going around that she fucked, that she was fucking Mark Anthony. Excuse my language. She was having sex with Mark Anthony. Okay? Which I don't understand that either. I mean, damn, you know. I, I mean, I would never justify cheating on your husband or your wife, but damn, cheat up. Don't cheat down. I mean, I'm just saying. Don't do it at all, but if you're going to do it, cheat up, don't cheat down. Mark Anthony? Dude was in like one movie. American Me, right? I think that's what it was. American Me, In and Out, some shit like that. But anyway, one movie, he had one hit song, and you going to cheat. You, you, you have Will Smith. One of his highest paid actors in Hollywood. A dude that keeps himself in shape, works out and shit. Known as an action hero, pretty much. And you, and if the rumors are true, which I have a feeling they are, because Jada ain't no damn good anyway. But anyway, no, I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to say that. I don't know her. She might be a cool person. I don't know. But all I know is she's disrespecting Will, which is bullshit. Okay? But anyway, um, you going to cheat on, on, on that with Mark Anthony? Anyway, but, <laughs> but anyway, but basically what I'm saying is that, Will, you can do better. Do better, man. You need to go ahead and drop her like a bad habit, man, and get you a woman that's going to treat you right. There's so many beautiful actresses in Hollywood, and even if you don't want to go Hollywood, well, even if you just want to go with just regular, you know, homegirl from down the street, from your hood or something like that, or just anybody. There are too many beautiful women out there in the world for you to be dealing with Jada trifling ass. I'm just saying. I mean, they say that she slept with your, with your son's friend 
If that's true, and I think the excuse she gave was we were on break, I don't give a damn. I don't care if you on a break. I don't care if you legally separated. You don't sleep with your son's friends. You just don't do the shit. It's nasty. You just don't do it. Your son has enough things to worry about than to have to worry about if his mom is going to try to fuck his friend. Really? But anyway, you know, but yeah, so Will, you can do better, you know, and if those rumors are not true, I apologize. But if those rumors are true and she did sleep with your son's friend, you, oh shit, that's some nasty shit. Anyway, but you can do better, Will, okay? You need to get you one of them other beautiful actresses. I know it's going to hurt. I know it's going to hurt if you guys get divorced. She's going to take half your shit, like Eddie Murphy said in Raw. She's going to get half your shit. Sorry, it's the way it goes. But, you're Will Smith. You can make that money right back. She's Jada Pickett. She's going to blow through that money and she's going to be forgotten. Because ain't nobody going to give me no, no damn movie roles. She's one of the most hated women in, in America now. Ain't nobody gonna give her no damn movie roles. Okay? Ain't nobody gonna do it. Okay? They're not. Sorry. So give her half your shit so you can find you a better woman that's gonna treat your ass right. A woman who, if she's an actress, she'll be making movies and bringing money to the table. Which may be something you're not accustomed to anymore. Since Jada ass probably hasn't been bringing money to the, to the table since the movie set it off, probably. I mean, I'm just saying, bro, you can do better. I have mad respect for you, Will. I love your music. I think you're one of the best actors out there. I think you're a good, positive, black role model for, you know, fellow brothers out there. You know, I love how you came up. Got mad respect for you, man. It hurts me to see her treat you like this and just emasculate you like that, man. You better than that shit. You need to go ahead and drop her ass. Because like I say, you Will Smith, bro. There are probably hundreds of women. You could probably snap your fucking fingers, Will, and have a hundred women trying to marry your ass. So it's not like you hurting. It's not like you one of them ugly ass brothers, you know, <laughs> trying to, you know, one of them ugly ass broke brothers trying to get you trying to get you some, bro. You will fucking Smith. You, I mean, you can just smile, you know. Come on, man. Snap your fingers. Have a bunch of women trying to get you some. Trying to give you some. And you dealing with a woman that's treating you like shit and you trying to sit there and deal with that? Hell no, brother. You need to do better. Anyway, this is your man. Like I said, I mean no disrespect to your woman. I'm not going to say she's a bad person. I say the way she's treating you is bad. But, bro, you can do better. Definitely do better. It's your man Harris Mouth.